Hi everyone, I'm Rezovan from MammothInteractive.com and in this video I'm going to show you how to use decimal numbers in Android Studio. Just so you know, there's a 10 hours free course about coding in the description, but for now we're going to go in Android Studio in the project view and we're going to open the main activity and we're going to close this uh, project view right now. And in order to implement decimal numbers in Android Studio, we have to use this keyword called double and then we can go and uh, give the name for our variable. In this example I'm gonna give you um, the example of uh, online store in this video and let's say price let's say we have some items and the price is displayed in CAD in Canadian dollars and we want to have the price in USD. Okay in order to do that we need to have um, the conversion rate so we're gonna declare a constant so let's say final double final is just the keyword for constants and the double is the data type so right now we're gonna call it CAD to USD and we're gonna set it equal to 0 0.76 which is a conversion rate at this moment and let's say the price in CAD is 9 point something but just so, just to make sure, if I put just $9, it's going to give me an error because it says it, f it was found uh, integer and they want uh, a double variable. So basically, I'm going to put, if you want to have it 9, then we have to put 9.0 and you see there's no, no error right here. But we can just say 9.55 and you also can use negative numbers, but we're not going to use that in this video. So the price in USD is going to be equal to the price in CAD and it's going to be multiplied by CAD to USD which is a conversion rate and we're going to use a toast message to display this on the screen so notice I just type toast and then I hit enter and it just sets up all the parameters for us and I'm going to put our string over here which we want to display on the screen and we're going to say the price in US the price in USD is and then I'm just gonna add up this um, the value of the variable price USD. So I'm gonna run the emulator and I'm gonna see what's gonna be displayed over here. I'm gonna zoom in so we can see better the message that's gonna be displayed and it's gonna pop up just shortly over here. It says the price in USD is that one uh, and it was seven point something and it just has about 15 decimal places we probably don't want to show the price like that so I'm just gonna show you how to format it to two decimal places so I'm gonna do string that format okay and I'm just gonna enclose all this string that we have over here in brackets just so you see these brackets over here okay and there is one more thing we have to put um, parameter which is a local and well I can say Canada but probably you're not in Canada so we're just gonna use the default to so get default okay and next thing we want to do is we're not gonna concatenate it basically we're just gonna put a comma over here and we're gonna put a placeholder for the first decimal that appears after the comma so basically we're gonna say percent F and that stands for floating point number and basically if you want if you want to have more display more uh, numbers over there we can put like this so basically this says the first number and the second number so it's gonna take the value of this price it's gonna put it over here and let's say we have another one let's say 2 2.45 and it's gonna put this number over here in this place but for now I'm just gonna use one um, one of these uh, placeholders and I'm just gonna put 0.2 to specify that we want only two decimal places so right now if I just run the emulator again you're gonna see the price is gonna be displayed with two decimal places so you're gonna see it's only 7.26 and that's more convenient and that's basically all you have to know about double variables in Android Studio you can go on mammothinteractive.com to see our projects and if you haven't checked it already, go and watch that 10 hours free course about coding. And thank you very much for watching this video.